I'm here today with Sunish Kashav, who is the uh, Vice President of Application Development at Safeway. Welcome, Sunish. Thank glad to be here. So, Sunish, uh, companies know more and more about their customers uh, nowadays, and uh, grocery stores were kind of a, at the cutting edge in terms of gathering this information with loyalty cards. Um, how have you seen changes over the last couple of years in terms of the richness of information and what you can do with that information you get from, uh, from customers? Um, sure. So, um, you're right. The uh, grocery stores in general have been in the business of collecting customer information for a long time. We were one of the first retailers, for instance, to introduce the loyalty card. And about 90% of our customers use the loyalty card when they shop with us. And for the longest time, we were storing all that data about what our customers' shopping habits were, what they were buying from us in a data warehouse and didn't really know what to do with it. Over the last two years, what I'll say is that this, we've seen an advance in technology to the point where that large amount of data that we've all been sitting on in the retail industry is now becoming a really powerful way to market to our customers. In our case, we uh, about three years ago launched a customer-facing loyalty program and that is completely powered by the data that we have on our customers and what we know about them. So rather than compete with uh, the likes of a Walmart on a everyday low price basis, now we are able to offer differentiated pricing because we know what you, Greg, mm -hmm. as a customer is shopping for versus someone else. That was not possible even mm -hmm. two, three years ago. Now, as the introduction of an online channel, Safeway.com, does this uh, make it easier or does this increase the, the complications associated with uh, keeping all that data together? Well, in terms of connecting to the customer, I think it makes a huge difference for us. When you think about a, the grocery retail shopping behavior of our customers, and even though they identify themselves to us in that they use their loyalty club card for shopping, it's usually on their way out of the store. You're in the checkout mm -hmm. lane, you swipe your card, and it's too late to react to or do any sort of constructive marketing or dialogue with that customer at that point. What digital, primarily mobile and web, has provided us with this are channels to take that conversation out of the grocery store and back home with the customer. So we can engage in a pre-shopping dialogue with our customers even before they step into our stores. That's been huge for us. We'd love to now identify shoppers as they walk into the store, because even with all the advances in digital, it seems like the, the sliding doors as you walk through a grocery store are the great equalizer, because once you walk in, we cannot differentiate between customers. Everyone gets the same marketing messages, the same prices, and so we'd love to change that. And I think digital, mobile, and web are the way to go to get there. Right, but this information is not just useful uh, in the relationship you have with your customers, but it's also useful in the relationship you have with your suppliers. Um, to what extent uh, do you cooperate with your suppliers in sharing information about your customers and helping to uh, create a better experience both on the operational side and the marketing side? Now, we are, we are very sensitive about the big brother effect in play in terms of sharing information about our customers with anyone outside our, our uh, four walls. Having said that, we have a number of partnership programs in play with, cus with our um, CPG partners and um, even folks like uh, companies like Chevron and Exxon, where we have a fuel program partnership with them, where um, it's not so much about exchanging customer information as um, augmenting the value that we would provide our customers by forming a coalition. So for instance, with, in case of Chevron today, if you shop for um, a, at a Safeway store, for every $100 that you spend at Safeway, you get 20 cents off a gallon of gas at Chevron. Um, the technical challenges associated with being able to communicate from the point of sale at Chevron all the way to our centralized loyalty system at Safeway in three seconds, which is what the customer will wait for before they mm -hmm. give up, um, is, is huge. And, uh, it's put a lot of pressure on, on me and my team in terms of being able to make those systems work flawlessly, but the customers are delighted with the uh, value prop. Sunish, thanks for coming today. Thank you. Thank you for having me.